As this act begins, Philip is very busy. Too busy to spend time with Robbie. Dad and I were planning to go to the game, but he has to work today. So Grandpa has an idea. Maybe uh, your dad and I could take you fishing with us. But Robbie knows Philip probably can't go. But Dad is always so busy. So Grandpa talks to Philip. You're working pretty hard these days. I guess I am. What does Philip decide to do? indeed. Hand me two eggs from the refrigerator and I'll make you two fried eggs. How about some bacon? Well, I've made enough for an army. You going to the baseball game today? It's a perfect day for it. A little cloudy, but nice and warm. Dad and I were planning to go to the game, but he has to work today and my friends don't want to go. It's not an important game anyway. Do you have any other plans for the day? Well, I'll work on my computer. I have a new math program and I want to learn how to use it. Well, maybe you can teach me how to work on a computer someday. Anytime. It's really easy, but like anything, you need to work at it, Grandpa. Mm -hmm. <sighs> this bacon is great. I love crispy bacon. <laughs> well, what are you doing tomorrow? Nothing much. Well, maybe uh, your dad and I could take you fishing with us. I'd like that, but... But what? Uh, but Dad is always so busy. Well, uh, can you come fishing with me tomorrow? Sure I can. <laughs> Robbie says you can't take him to the game today. I really feel bad about it, but they, uh, they need me at the hospital today in the children's ward. I understand. Maybe we can spend some time together next weekend. Definitely. We should. You and Robbie and me. Remember our first fishing trip? I sure do. Well, I've got to run, Dad. See you later. Oh. Are we fishing? I'm thinking about it. Oh, how's work? Uh, all the usual problems. <laughs> You're working pretty hard these days. I guess I am. When did you last go fishing with Robbie? Oh, I remember exactly. Uh, it was on his birthday, June 2nd, two years ago. <laughs> we didn't catch anything. <laughs> remember our fishing trips? Yes. I loved them. Remember catching your first fish? <laughs> How could I forget I fell out of the boat? <laughs> uh, we had some good times together. Yes, we did. Maybe we should do it again. How about tomorrow? Don't you have to work? My paperwork will wait. Oh, Robbie will be thrilled. I am too, son. We'll spend more time with Robbie. Tomorrow. It'll be like old times for you and me. And Robbie will love it. <laughs> well, what's the weather going to be like? Radio says sunny and mild. Oh. <laughs> well, I'll tell Robbie. And, uh, thanks, Dad. Don't thank me. I'm just being a grandfather.
What's the weather going to be like? Radio says sunny and mild. What's the weather going to be like in the USA today? In New York City, home of the Statue of Liberty and all those skyscrapers and the surrounding area, it'll be sunny and mild. A little cloudy, but nice and warm. What a beautiful day to do some fishing. Down in the southeast today, the weather will be gorgeous. In Miami, Florida, a popular vacation spot, it's going to be sunny and hot, hot, hot. It's 90 degrees Fahrenheit, that's 32 degrees Celsius now. A perfect day for the beach. <sighs> Not so in St. Louis, Missouri, the gateway to the west. It's cool and windy. We expect rain there and throughout the Midwest this afternoon. So get out your umbrella. And in the Rocky Mountains, it's freezing. Ooh. It's 32 degrees Fahrenheit, that's zero degrees Celsius, outside Denver, Colorado. There's two feet of snow already, and it's gonna snow some more. It's a perfect place for skiing. Out on the West Coast in Los Angeles, California, home of Hollywood movie stars and fast cars, it's sunny and warm. It'll be a beautiful day for a drive up the coast. And that's the weather in the USA Today.